Just for today, December 22nd, a new way to live. When at the end of the road we find that we can no longer function as a human being, either with or without drugs, we all face the same dilemma. Either go on as best we can to the bitter ends jails, institutions or death or find a new way to live. Basic text, page 84. What was the worst aspect of active addiction? For many of us, it wasn't the chance that we might die some day of our disease. The worst part was the living death we experienced every day, the never-ending meaninglessness of life. We felt like walking ghosts, not living, loving parts of the world around us. In recovery, we've come to believe that we're here for a reason, to love ourselves and to love others. In working the 12 steps, we have learned to accept ourselves. With that, self-acceptance has come self-respect. We have seen that everything we do has an effect on others. We are a part of the lives of those around us and they of ours. We've begun to trust other people and to acknowledge our responsibility to them. In recovery, we've come back to life. We maintain our new lives by contributing to the welfare of others and seeking each day to do that better. That's where the 10th, 11th and 12th steps come in. The days of living like a ghost are past, but only so long as we actively seek to be healthy, loving, contributing parts of our own lives and the lives of others around us. Just for today, I have found a new way to live. Today, I will seek to serve others with love and to love myself.